Hey guys, well, what's up? My name is Chris and welcome back to Toki Dead 2. So we're going to explore the Age of War a bit today, but we can't stay out too long because we do have that exposure limit to consider. So we're just going to do a little bit of exploring, kind of see if we can at least get a barrier stone out of this or not. Unfortunately, it does take a while to get here though from our main barrier stone in the Age of Honor. So yeah, it does take a while to get here. It, I remember this being kind of annoying, just tr having to constantly go back and forth until we got the story mission where we could actually go and purify the Age of War. But anyway, I also looked up more about the um, the the one thing. Um, anyway, that's pretty. I looked up more about the waterfall thing. I couldn't find anything, but I swear to God that it was like an actual thing that you can do. Like I remember doing it, so I don't know. I didn't find anything on Google, which is super weird, so. You can actually go up here. And go up even higher. Oh, it doesn't look like it. Okay, well. I don't really want to fight you guys, just saying. I just want to explore the area and such. We got some new um, enemies over there too. I don't think we've fought these guys before. They're pretty unique, pretty nice. I like them. Uh, we also got some new armor from facing the Glacier Bell. I bought one of the pieces, so maybe I'll show you later if I remember. They're okay. I think I like them better on the guys than the female version of it. Um, at least the bottoms. I don't remember. I, th I think I only remember partially of what it looked like. On the females, but I think I like the male better. Whoop, we need to go in here. The barrier stone. That's a really awkward place to spawn in here. Like, really awkward place to spawn, dude. Just saying. Can he jump out? I don't know if he can even jump out. Like,. Okay, we at least got this. That way we can teleport quickly if we need to. Which again is going to be probably what's going to happen with our um, Miasma level. But once we purify this, we should be able to get our exposure level back down to zero. So we can start over, do a little bit more exploring. I kind of wish I had opened this up sooner and actually gone over here. That one was my bad. We do actually have quests. I'll look at them later. We do have quests to do here so maybe we can get those taken care of or I might just wait until after we do the next story mission because we're an important place in the story you know we're picking our next chief that's really important and here we are just you know spending time out and about um, you know keeping them from doing their job because they have to wait for us of course how are you doing dude Get a little attack boost up here. Nice one. Whoever did that, I don't know. Pardon me, sir. I didn't like that very much. I should have recorded this episode sooner, but I was just like, hey, videos on YouTube. I'm going to watch those. When I don't have that much time, I am tired from work, so I don't plan on staying up forever. But I wanted to record a whole bunch, so it's really just... Oh, okay. Oh, no. Oh, my... Oh, no. Beneza key! Bene Beneza key! Thank, thank. Okay, I had to wait for her to come up for you to actually bother. You should really worry about saving the people who are dying and not the person who is going to eventually wake up anyway. Just saying. Um, but at least um, she used that move so she saved me and Kamawa. Hey! Got herself another minute. Oh, I forgot to look at those. God damn it. I was gonna do that, but I forgot. Tass. So let's see. So yeah, we still have a corporal. Um, we need Petro's Hornbit, which we won't get till we actually fight Petro. And obtain some silver grass from Ikitsukahara, which we haven't been to yet. <laughs> I'm getting hiccups now, I don't like that. 
So we've had these guys for a long time now. Um, so maybe maybe we'll change them up a little bit. See if we can get some different boosts going on. Oh, it got darker all of a sudden. I don't like that. Why did you get super dark? We didn't move that far. So we're heading up here. It would be nice to go this direction, but I think we'll just do that later. We'll just head up. I think we're going in the direction of the silver grass location anyway, so I think that'd be best to do and get that done and out of the way. Okay. You guys really don't need to fight everything. I think those are called sickle claws. Yep, they are. Hey, I was right. But you guys really don't need to fight everything. Just saying. You know, I'm not. So you guys don't need to. Ah, uh, the Age of War brings back some memories of other games that are related to this era. Hey, someone's down there. Uh, probably Wind Shredder. Or Sky Shredder. I think it's about time we're due for a Sky Shredder, actually. Because we fought Wind Shredders, which are not- we haven't fought too many, but we haven't run to a Sky Shredder yet, so... I'm sure those have been on the list for a while now. Probably will fight that. Maybe. Uh, I guess so. Hi. I'm pretty sure it's a Sky Shredder. Mmm. I don't really have the best team. I kind of wish I didn't have Kamiwa for this, actually. Spocky would be better. Or Tokutsugu. Oh well, we'll just have to deal with it. I didn't- I f totally forgot there was a Sky Shredder here. We really have not fought these guys very often. I just realized that. Like, we fight like one every like 20 episodes, I feel like. We really just don't fight that many of them. Is that a quest up there? I think that is. I see it like in the very corner of the map. Which I should pay attention to the actual battle so I don't end up dying again. Well, I don't fully die, but you know, close enough. I cl cl close enough. Dude, not cool. Very not cool. I can take you in your butt, goddammit. Oh, I'm out of stamina. Okay, fine, be that way. I don't need my stamina anyway. I am getting really tired, guys, actually. Oh, shit. It is a busy day today. It started out super slow at work, but then it just, like, really picked up. Um. So a lot of people. A lot. There's always a lot of people that come in that always look like they're super angry, but then they're not. And I'm just. I'm just like, I don't, I don't know, you look really pissed off and it makes me not want to like meant talk to you because I don't want to get yelled at for no reason because customers will do that sometimes, you know, like if it's something that's completely not our fault, they of course take it out on us. So I always try to be nice and avoid that, but sometimes it's unavoidable. Can I get your tail? Hang on, hang, 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 hang. dude, hang on, I want your tail. Got it. I think the wings one is my favorite actually now. Now that we saw it a whole bunch last episode, I think I like the wing one. Yeah, there's just a lot of people that come in that look really pissed off. They just kind of have that face, you know? Like they're actually really nice or like they turn into a smile as soon as they get up to the registers, but like you see them otherwise, they look like they're ready to punch someone. I, I don't know. Did you, where'd your face go? What? His eyes just like suddenly disappeared on me. Okay. You're fine, dude. I'm sure you're fine. See, his eyes are back. It's good. Maybe he just got super dark in that area or something. How are you looking? Uh, we can use another little attack boost. Oh, hello. I do like the designs of these guys. They're pretty cool. We finally got our super, one of our supervisors back too, because one of our store locations closed down, and um, it was pretty like terrible to be perfectly honest with you. Oh, we're in the we're in a bad zone actually. 
And so, like, nobody liked working there at all. Like, they never even had employees that lasted more than a couple months. The store was just awful, so, like, it was kind of about time that it closed down. The location was terrible, the building was terrible, and just the clientele were apparently not as, you know, not as, not as nice. Um, it was basically our Portland store, and I live in Oregon. In case you don't know, Portland is pretty big on the homeless population, and a lot of those homeless population, unfortunately, steal a lot, mainly carts. Uh, they had a big problem with cart theft in that store, but just there's a lot of thieves in that part of Portland, and that was just that was just big. Uh, if you ever go to Portland, I just say don't. I don't like it very much. I don't like going there. Again, the homeless population is way too high and they encourage it, which is never a good thing. You should not encourage homelessness. Um, but then, of course, the everything over there is super expensive, so, you know, that's probably why they encourage it, because no one can afford to live there anyway, which is really stupid. If they want to get rid of the homeless population, maybe they should lower the prices of crap, but they don't. Uh up there interesting interesting okay well I want to get that first we're gonna have to do a little bit here oh are you okay what do you want with me I don't know I just want to chat sorry but I don't fight anymore after a mighty struggle I finally managed to die that that really sounds depressing dude now I just rest quietly amongst these dead, these death blossoms. <laughs> okay. Do not disturb me. Only one thing can make me change my mind. <laughs> Miyamoto Musashi, I still want to fight him. Ah, oh, I think this is the dude I never got. Because I never found his minima. Again, a lot of minima are up to chance. Some of them you will always get with certain bosses, but a lot of them are just up to chance and it his I just never got ever Ooh, let's go get that barrier stone up there because then I think we'll head back and start the story again because we've explored this place a decent amount you can kind of understand what um what the age of war is like and before I rant too much again about how I don't like Portland and all that stuff again I don't recommend it there are better places to visit it's just like it just was oh my god Beniza key. Oh no, I don't want you to attack. Beniza key. Beniza key. You okay? You're you're good. I can't believe you just. Okay. Oh, she's up. Thank you. This is why I bring a healer just in case. You know. Just in case. <laughs> All right. So let's go ahead and um. Do we need to talk to the professor? Maybe. I guess so. We can go talk to the professor. I don't remember what for, it's been a little bit. But hey, Professor, we're back. We went to the Age of War finally. Oh, hey, Home Rosa. Oh, hey, all of you. Why are we in here again? <laughs> I guess we're having a meeting. Ah, it's you. Who else would it be? How was it? Did you talk with the Grand General? Oh, yeah, that's right. Double memory loss? Seriously? You're doubling down? I see, so you're right back at the beginning. Yeah. It's not easy, is it, to find out a person's past? Regardless of that past, however, you have something you need to do, right? Do I? Yes. Good, then fight, Makina user. Having purified two regions so far, I've been able to confirm that the Oni hate areas with weak miasma. Oni activities are definitely slowing down. If you keep this up then before too long, the village should be safe. We've closed the Mihasma holes in the Age of Peace and the Age of Honor. Next up is the Age of War. Start by finding a minima. The sets of Bun holiday is over. Time to get back to work. Take Benizuki, Homer, and Kamara with you and head to the Age of War. Hold. <laughs> Hold on a moment. What's this samurai doing here? What do you care? You're not a guard. You always fight powerful enemies. I want to fight them too. I'm with you, Chris. Ah, do you have a death wish? It's reassuring to have you along. Thank you so much, Kamiwa. Try to keep it friendly, please. Luckily enough, there have been sightings of an oni called Jolix, which is an Edax. Y you know. 
to feed and attain a minima. Round and round we go. You can complain once you finish working, Homura. I'll try. I was just there, but okay. Yeah. I know, I know where the Age of War is, okay. I guess we'll get another entrance, which is gonna be... We're gonna open up this entrance here. So I think the thing's over here though, um, if I remember correctly, but really it's gonna be faster going down that way <laughs> than it is going the route that we went to begin with. So let's see what minima do we have. Oh, you teach me a combination boost. These are special boosts that are triggered when you equip certain minima. Minima that share a strong bond during their lifetimes will have an icon to vote denoting the friendship or relationship. While minima that offer a boost when equipped will be also marked with the icon. Okay. Let's see. We have Lady Tomoe, which we can check out the artwork, which I really love. We only got these two, which is still my DLC one, and then, yeah. Aw, so cute. So she will have a boost, um, if we equipped her, which I might do that. She'll have a special boost because she has relations with Minamoto, who we have. Oh yeah, I forgot about her. <laughs> I don't know, we've been doing quite well with him, but... He's got support. He's got that luck that I don't care about. We don't have anyone that has attack, though, which kind of bugs me. We don't have a lot of minima. I was thinking that we're kind of building up a good thing here. Oh, you got attack, but I don't care about the luck one. So I think what we're going to do is go ahead. There we go. Got our combination boost. So that increases the max size of the health gouge. Thank you. I'll take that. You know, it's nice. We don't always need that defensive wall. She'll restore some HP, so I'll take it. Um... I do like Leech. I still do like Might, of course. I don't care about the cooldown time. Stores an amount of focus based on the damage inflicted. Okay. What about you? Uh, okay, that's fine. Yeah, I know I have inactive boosts. I don't give a damn. And the bonds of matrimony, which I guess they're married, so. How's that? Uh, I don't really want to go back and do that. I'm kind of lazy now. Oh yeah, let's show you guys the uh, new armor. At least the armor that I bought, which we can just go back to the blacksmith. Hey, Tenko! Oh yeah, do you only want a minima? Can I get you a minima yet? Oh, you have to be level 3 or higher. Damn it. We'll give you another snack, but I'm not going to take you out today. Which I get kind of sad about, but... <laughs> you know. I don't want to put you in too much... Oh, I didn't mean to fortify. I wanted to show the new armor. So, it's a silly... Oh, hey. We got even new stuff. You're, you're not. We got a ninja mask now. Um, we got the Dawn Slayer helmet. God damn, that's huge. We got the veteran helm. This is the one that we unlocked last time, which I guess is a weird cap. Crimson Helm. We got that guy, and we got that, which is like outfits from the first game. We're getting all the ninja outfit. Hooray! This is the top for this one, which I think looks so much better on the guys. I still don't like it too much, but hey. Ooh, this looks nice on the guy. Oh, I don't have a sickle. I guess maybe I should have killed a lot more of the sickle claws. <laughs> oh, well, we'll fight a whole bunch of them, so I'll definitely get more of those guys. 
Ooh, I like the ninja gloves. I'm I'm tempted. I think I'm gonna go for those. Those look really nice with this outfit. Yeah, we're equipped in those bad boys. A little bright for my liking. Not too bad. Oh yeah, these are the chill wave ones. I gotta remember to show you guys the chill wave. And then we got the bottoms. We got the ninja. These look so skinny on the guy. Veteran, I bought this guy, which I like. I like the, whenever it parts in the back like that on outfits for men. I, I love it. Oh, the female version of this looks better. Do we have any new weapons? No. We, they really cut back on weapons in this game, I swear to God. Maybe we should do a little bit of forging. Nope, we need hit, we need hit more fangs. I don't wanna. And to me, it doesn't matter about actually doing all this stuff. I know I have an active boost. I don't give a damn. I don't care about your stupid inactive boosts. I took it to you having fun. I think I'm gonna go ahead and um, go to the shrine because we're gonna be involving in that stuff. Um. Yeah, we'll go for this. And then we'll go to the hot spring too. Get some of that boost going on. I was like grabbing the minimum one because I don't care about getting the boost up quickly. I just like collecting as much minima as I possibly can. So there's that. Has it already been 25 minutes? What the heck? I don't think I'm cutting anything out. Hey, you! Why do you want to train in the bath? What's wrong with you? More like the two of you shared a battle than a bath. Jesus. All right, we got our boosts. Thank you, thank you. Building material I don't care about, but whatever. Does she have any other quests for us? Could fight a lot. We could fight 10 Suckle Claws right here. Right here, right now. Also, yeah, okay, we haven't fought that guy yet. I swear, like, I was, like, super confused. But, yeah, we haven't fought a Scorpio Claw yet. Oh, I forgot to look for the silver glass. I just, we'll go back there. We're going back there. I don't know if we'll ever find Musashi. There's, like, two of them that require you to find another Minima, at least that I remember, and one... I know one of them I couldn't find the other person. I think it was this one. But anyway, guys, I'm going to end this episode off here. So I hope you all enjoyed it. And so next time we'll go back to the Age of War and hopefully find ourselves a minima after defeating the Jolix. So yeah, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.